Hey, what's up guys? My name is Mikael Williams. I'm a CISO alumnus. And today I'm gonna walk around, show you guys the, the CISO campus, especially since we've been in a pandemic the last year. You know, I know a lot of you guys probably haven't been able to actually be on campus and see the buildings and everything like that. So I'm gonna hopefully help you guys out with that, kind of give you a gist of what stuff looks like inside and out. And, um, you know, first I'm standing in front of the engineering and math uh, lab uh, building. And, you know, I'm gonna go in and each building show you what's up. And of course, since we're still in the pandemic, I'm gonna have to mask up since masks are um, required inside each building. So I'm gonna show you guys around. Guys, we're in the EMB building, uh, second floor. This is the second floor lounge. Um, you can see it's a pretty cool space. There's a bunch of students that come in here and kind of just do work on projects, meet up with a friend, do different stuff. Obviously, you know, you see here, there's like a little projector where you can plug in your computer or your phone and work on your stuff on a bigger screen and everything like that. So it's a nice kind of chill area for you to kind of get your work done and hang out with friends. Guys, now after watching the, and looking at the lounge and everything like that, we're gonna head up to the third floor to the math lab. Right, guys, so now we're in the math lab and back there is the testing center. And pretty much this is a really nice area to truly get, you know, focused and get your work done. Um, if you come over here, those like little clipboards over there is where you'd pretty much sign in, you know, first and last name, your time of arrival, what class, um, you're in for, for in here for um, and then pretty much if you needed to go get a test done for whatever reason let's say you missed a class or something and your teachers allowing you to make up for it or you can go into this door right here and use any of the computers in there pretty much before you get in uh, there'd be a lady or, or a man right here asking you to put your belongings in the cubbies over there and they'd hand you a, a key and you put it in and then you're pretty good to you know use a, a testing center if you wanted just to kind of get some simple work done or anything like that you could use these computers over here or if you had like just uh if you didn't need a computer and you just wanted to get some other work done you could use any of these desks right here and stuff like that and pretty much the entire time while you're in here this is completely si silent just because they want everybody to um, focus as much as possible so this is a great resource to use for you guys i personally used it a couple times when i was here and it helped me out a lot guys so we're on the third floor in the emb building uh this is another lounge area where you can go and work uh pretty much a cool space cool area kind of like the same concept except you know there's uh more whiteboards and everything like that and there's actually charging spaces uh for your phone as well so you can get your work done and charge your phone at the same time hey so what's up guys we're still on the third floor of the emb building a kind of overview of like the uh, athletic department over there um you know when it's warm outside you know there's a lot of students that come out here and do work and stuff like that really pretty area and you know more space to pretty much do your school work or whatever you got to do what's up guys so now we're just outside building a and in building a there's registration and admission and the library and so now i'm going to take you into the library those uh, uh, doors you know what i'm talking about those doors right <laughs> right there we're gonna go in those buildings or in those doors and you know i'll show you guys the library one of my favorite spots where you see me all the time studying and working on my homework and stuff like that all right guys so now this is cecil's lovely library uh this is again where i used to be at all the time during the school year you know i would be in this area doing school work or be on the computer and now they actually put in some new um charging stations and everything like that so you know there's always a spot for you to charge your phone so that your phone never dies um obviously you know we got all the cool books here and everything you know how it goes in the library um back here too i used to be back here a lot um pretty much you know an area to you know do more school work on the computer if you needed to and you kind of get that little the little privacy you know what i'm saying so um yeah so it's a good area and um you know Get yourself in here a few so times. I'm sure a lot of you guys have been in this part of the building already, the admissions. And this is Crystal. I'm sure you guys have met Crystal. If not, she's a great person and she works the front desk. And if we look to the right here, oh man, who is this good looking fella? Minus the hair. Do you see a resemblance? Yeah, I know you do. It's all good. You know, we, we making moves over here. We making moves over here. Let's let's go down here in the office. Let's find the, the main man of the hour. Oh, the legend Jerome. What's going on? Help, a helpful guy. Uh, works in admissions and one of the basketball coaches and stuff like that. So hopefully I'm sure you'll be able to talk to him a little bit as well. Yep, All right, coach. Yep. So we just got done touring building A 
And so now this is kind of like the quad area and everything like that. Again, when it's really nice out here, you'll see a lot of, a lot of students out here just kind of hanging out, chilling. There's also a lot of different events that happen um, in this area as well and everything. So it's a real chill area. And so now right behind me, we're gonna go into the Building C, Arts and Science Building. I'm gonna show you guys the Writing Center, another very important piece here, another very helpful piece to help you with your writing. You know, pretty much help you to prepare to write a book if you want. <laughs> but this is a really good area for you to use. And uh, yeah, I'm about to show you guys. So as you can see, this is the Writing Center. You know, a lot more computers in here and everything for you to work on your papers and stuff. And to go back over here in those cubicles and stuff, there's always someone there to kind of help you with your writing. Um, and so like, you'll pretty much get help whenever you want and everything. Pretty much you would just come over here um, and I believe you log in right in here. So right on, right on this and everything like that. And then you're good to go to use any of this in here and use all the resources. I know that while, you know, we're all working and everything like that, um, we tend to get hungry and stuff like that. So if you see behind me, there's the uh, the food pantry and pretty much you can just come in and, you know, get a little light like, snack and stuff like that just to kind of keep you focused and, you know, locked into all your work. And I would say for me personally, another really important key about CISO is everyone here is to help you. You know, like there's always somebody here to help you with anything that you need with and everything. So pretty much, you know, failure is up to you because there's so many different resources and everything like that. You have really no choice but to succeed. So there's help 24 seven and you know, you don't ever have to worry about kind of feeling stuck or anything like that, you know, just because there's someone who is willing to, you know, help you out. And as long as you're willing to put in the work, they're willing to go the extra mile to help you guys, out. So well. now I'm about to take you guys into the technology center, um, show you a couple spots and everything like that that are pretty cool. Um, but also don't forget with all these spots that I've been showing, um, you know, go to cecil.edu slash virtual support and, you know, you can find a bunch of different information there, um, different contact information and, you know, the hours of when things are opening up and everything. So let's take a look into the technology. Right, so now we're in the tech lounge and this is the biggest lounge on campus. And as you can see, there's, I'm going to show you the, the other side of the lounge, but there's plenty of seating. There's a bunch of different charging stations. Um, if, you know, if you didn't want to lock up your phone for it, with one of the charging stations, you know, there's open charging stations all over the place. Um, and this is another really popular area where a lot of students just come down here, uh, down the hall, which will go down there next as the bookstore. And like they have, you know, different snacks and drinks and stuff like that, that you can go and get as well and come back out here, eat it, drink it, um, and continue to do your work out here in the lounge with a, you know, nice little view of the forest as well. So second half of the tech lounge, um, actually, as you can see, there's, outdoor seating as well and everything like that you know so you know we're we're a fan of outside in the wilderness as you can see <laughs> and more um phone charging stations all, all that good stuff right, now we're gonna go head into the bookstore you know you obviously you're gonna see some books and everything but they also have some of the you know best snacks and drinks in here as well right, so, so now we're in the bookstore uh, as you can see this is a well diverse area you know you got your little binders and stuff over there we got some nice snacks over here, you know, you got all the Cecil gear for winter, spring, fall, all that, all that good stuff. And then, you know, we got the drinks over here and then we got these lovely people working over here and everything like that. So pretty much, uh, you know, grab anything you need in here and, uh, and then you can bring it back to the lounge and stuff like that and, you know, get back to work. What's up guys? So now we're about to, we're just outside of the student life office and we're about to go check into that. You know, if you're a, student, a new student here and everything, make sure you come in and check this out. You know, they have a peer mentoring program that's popping up. Um, they have a bunch of different clubs and everything like that. And uh, now we're about to go in and check out the Zenden that they have um, and, you know, talk to some of the people who are working there. Right, well. So this is the kind of lounge for the student life and everything, right? So we go in here, kind of nice chill area, a real chill vibe. And then to our right, we got the lovely Zenden area, all right? Here are the rules, you know, gotta have rules. And so now we're gonna go in here. Would you look at that, another food pantry, you know what I'm saying? Nice little chill area and everything to kind of sit down, relax, you know. Got food to my right, water right here. You know, you all see ah, Oh yeah, this is nice, real nice, you know what I'm saying? Especially if you're a student athlete here or even a student who just, you know, works really hard here. You, you're gonna need to zen den, you know what I'm saying? You're gonna need time to chill out and hang out. So this is the perfect spot for you. Right, now we're gonna go talk to Miss, oh, hello, how you doing there? What's going on? <laughs> now we're gonna talk to a lovely lady who works in student life, the head director, Miss Cheryl. You know, she's here to help you out with everything and anything that you need and everything. She's a great person. How you doing? Hello. 
All right. Make sure you go stop by and see her and say what's up. Yeah. See you later. Guys, this is the last stop. This is the E building, um, also known as the PE building. Uh, this is where a lot of the athletes come and stay. This is where I spent a lot of time. Um, a little bit about the building. You know, this is where the weight room is, one of my favorite spots. The gym is my favorite spot. You know, the basketball gym, that's where, you know, you'll see a lot of, that's where all the games are at, you know, volleyball, uh, basketball, everything like that. And there's also classes in here for, you know, physical training and everything like that. So it's a really active building, really pretty and nice building and stuff. So I'm excited to show you guys. All right, stuff. guys. So this is the first floor of the PE building, kind of the lounge area and everything. This is where, again, I used to spend a lot of my time and some of my friends used to hang out here too, you know, and when the TVs are on, they usually have, you know, like college basketball games or whatever on. And we used to just kind of sit here and watch the TV and kind of just hang out. You know, we also got a nice little vending machine area over here, you know, cause you know, you get, you always get hungry, especially as a student athlete, you know, so you got good options there. You know, you got the Gatorades, the water, more water, and you got some legit snacks over there. Um, and then if you come over here, this is actually an important room. This is where all the student athletes will be because of the study hall that has to be taking place. So, you know, you got your six computers or so here, and then you got a bunch of, you know, seating and stuff like that to get stuff done. Everything. So if you're a student athlete, this room will be very familiar. This will be like your second home. And then, so now, and then those doors right across over there, that's where the athletic trainer is, Taylor, great person. Sure, again, if you're a student athlete, you'll definitely meet her and see her and she'll see that she's a great person. So now let's take you guys now This is up the here. second floor of the PE building. Obviously, you know, a nice little lounge area right there. Again, where you'll see students. And then here, here are all like the offices and stuff like that of like, you know, the AD and stuff like that. The head coach also is in here as well. Um, and then, you know, once again, my favorite spot, it's a little dark right now and everything like that, but this is our spacious and very pretty gym. This is where all the magic happens. And then across from it is FWC, the Fitness and Wellness Center. Um, CISO has a lot of like good jobs and stuff here for students to use um, or to, to apply for. And so, you know, I've actually been working here all summer and stuff like that. This is my main spot right here, you feel me? You know, like that. And this is, you know, the nice little area of our um, weight room area. The first floor, we have two floors. It's kind of like for cardio and everything like that, you know, to kind of get your run on a little bit. You know, we got a bunch of little yoga balls and stuff like that, different mats and everything, you know, to get your warm up right. And then if we go downstairs, by the way, we always got TVs running and everything like that. Sports, news, weather, everything you can name. Beautiful, beautiful view of the, of the campus, you know what I'm saying? And then down here, This is where the heavy lifting is at. You know what I'm saying? You got the you got the benches over here, you got the squat racks, you got your dumbbells, all that good stuff and everything like that, you know? This is where you gain the muscle, you know what I'm saying? This is where you look in the mirror, you feel me, and you flex on them real quick one time, you know what I'm saying? Ooh, ooh, kill them. <laughs> What's up, guys? So today we're gonna end this tour um, behind the PE building, you know, near the ball fields and everything like that. Um, you know, if you look behind me, this is our ball field, softball area, baseball, all that. And then actually right behind me is the Charlie O'Brien facility, kind of where indoor um, batting practice and everything like that. Beautiful day out and everything. So I'm glad you guys get to see kind of what it, what it looks like and everything like that. And so here, you know, you got the beautiful woods in the back too, you know what I'm saying? Everything like that and perfect day to play ball. Right, guys, so that's the end of the tour. You know, I know that we've been in a, you know, pandemic for, you know, a while now and everything like that. And, you know, for you guys who are coming into CISO, I'm pretty sure you guys haven't really gotten to have that full feel of, that full vibe of what CISO can really bring to the table for you guys. And let alone everything's virtual. And, you know, that's cool to see things and stuff like that, but to actually really be on campus or have somebody actually show you the different facilities and stuff like that, that's a different vibe. So I really hope that, you know, this tour that I've done with you guys has helped you guys out a lot. And, you know, um, I hope you guys have a great year at CISO and you guys are going to go kill it. Good luck, guys.